In this video, I will show you how we can install and configure Palo Alto Firewall image in GNS3. Okay, so let me go to my GNS3. I am running GNS3 2241. You can follow the same on any GNS3 version. The VM is also connected. GNS3 VM. It's here. Okay, and it's working. So let's start. For that, I need to go to security devices. It's this one. So click on the security devices as mentioned, click on new template. Okay. And choose the first option, install an appliance from GNS3 server and click next. Here, click on the firewalls and go to the firewall. We are interested in Palo Alto. So it's here. It's mentioned Palo Alto network, PAVM and click install. Next, choose the default option, which is install the appliance on the GNS3 VM on this VM, it will be installed here. Okay, so click next. Uh, choose the key MU binary, the default one and click next. And here it will show you all the images. The only image which is green is basically I already put the same image, a uh, PAVM uh, version 10, QCOW2. I already put this in the download folder. So if I go to download folder, so I already keep them here. You can use the same image Oh, the one which you use in Eve NG. So it's the same MHPA VA, VM, sorry, KVM at 1000 QCOW2. Okay, so it will take automatically from the download folder. So let's choose the default one. As is mentioned, only the 10 version, not the 10 one, because it's missing. The only image which in my download folder is this one. So they found that one and click next. Okay, so click yes. It will show you that the default username and password is admin admin. Okay. And they say that you can set the IP address using these commands. So it's going to upload the QCOW2 image, which is almost 2.8 GB to this VM. Okay. It will be run from this VM. So it will take some time to upload this VM. And when it's done, then we can click finish and we can drag and we can use this image in our lab. If you want to create the topology in GNS3. Okay, so it's going to upload. It's almost done 97%. And with, when it's done, okay, it's showing you the username and password as well here. And they say, if you want to configure a static IPS, mention the commands as well and so for the DNS. Okay, it's done, it's uploaded and click finish. Okay, so the appliance has been installed and template name is PAVM. Uh, 1000 has been successfully created. Click OK and here is. So now drag, okay, PA. And if you want, you can change a lot of things from the configure template. Suppose you say that always don't give them this name just give them a PA, okay, and just put them here, anything so it can change. And you can change the symbol as well of the firewall and whatever you want. And you can change the default RAM and a lot of stuff. Anyway, it's done here. And what I need to do, I just need to let me take one cloud from here, net cloud, and let me connect to the net cloud. Okay. And let me connect the management interface to the net cloud right and start this device okay here is and right click and you can go to it's already start go to console so it will take some time to start and after that you need to type the username and password the default username and password is admin admin and when you type that username and password so you can log in it will get ip address automatically and you can type that ip in your browser to access this firewall so this is the way to deploy and configure palo alto firewall and gns3 okay so it's come up however it will not take the username and password you need to wait almost for uh, five to six minutes so let's see let me type admin and admin so you can see they say that login incorrect and the reason is we need to wait for a while 
then it will take the username and password okay so let me try again admin and password is admin okay enter old password admin and new password a b c at one two three four five a b c at one two three four five okay and we are logging successfully so show interface management and the ip address is get from the cloud is 114153 from this cloud i'm connected to the management so we can type this ip in the browser okay and sorry it should be https https and hit enter advanced and continue unsafe okay and type username admin and password the new one okay and hit enter okay and after that you can log in successfully here is the dashboard click close remind me later and this is the way to install Palo Alto Firewall Image and GNS3.